Hello family, friends, and anybody who wants to see me miss my face up. Today I'm doing a no makeup challenge. I'm, no makeup challenge. <laughs> Today I'm doing a no, no makeup challenge. Basically what that is, if you don't already know, it's you doing your makeup without a mirror. I can already hear how some of you are like, damn, this is going to go terribly wrong. Because it is. It is going to go terribly wrong. I wouldn't say like I'm fantastic at makeup. I can do the basics. Um, I guess that any girl really knows how to do. Feel free if you notice me doing anything wrong or something that you think I should change. Please feel free to comment down in the comment section. And yeah, let me know because I always love learning new stuff. Okay, and um, if you want to let me know how much of an idiot I look like, I'll be happy to know that too because I'm here for your entertainment. So, I am going to start cleaning my face. I am using Woolies Baby Wipes. Uh, I have used numerous facial wipes um, and I find that these are the best. They are meant for baby's bottoms, so they are for sensitive skin and I have quite sensitive skin. I honestly do not have a mirror anywhere. Um, the only mirror that is in this room is the one that is on that side of the room behind behind me. I love a clean face. It's the best. <laughs> I can stop now. Before I put any act on my face, I always moisturize. I always moisturize with the Olay Double Action. It is a day cream and a primer. It's the best of both worlds. I use this as a pre-primer. <laughs> now that that's over, let's start the makeup. So I'm going to go in with my primer. Um, it is the Infallible Mattifying Base by L'Oreal Paris. Um, that's what it looks like. This primer is really good. Really, really good. Um, I find that whenever I use it, my no matter what foundation I use, it never cakes at all. And that's always what you want. My forehead, just like, same with my, my cream. I put it in the same spot. Why do I feel like I put a lot on my face? Did I do this right now? I'm going to blend it in with my beauty blender. Um, I like to use a smaller beauty blender when I do the primer because I feel like I can um, just get every single inch of my skin. When I use the bigger beauty blender, I just feel like it just takes up all the product. Um, and hardly any of it gets into my skin. So once I've put on my primer, I know a lot of people, they start with the, the foundation first and then go into the eye. I like starting the eye first because I find that the excess product generally falls on my foundation. If I put my, any eyeshadow on, I like to go in with a eyeshadow base. So it helps, it enhances the color more. I'm going to use the Essence I Love Intensifying Eyeshadow Base. Okay, I'm so nervous because I actually don't know <laughs> what I'm doing. Okay, there's my eye. Oh, this feels really bad. <laughs> I think I got some in my eye. <laughs> And then I'm going to use the same little beauty blender. I don't know because I don't have a mirror. I'm going to go in with the Catrice Nude Collection Eyeshadow Palette. I'm just going to use the top color. I'm just going to use that color over there. Get that on there and hit off the excess and just go in circular motions and I just like to bring it out until the end of my eyebrow oh but wait I can't see where the end of my eyebrow is okay and I'm gonna go into the other side 
get that in my tear duct. So I was thinking of maybe doing like a little burgundy kind of <laughs> eye. Um, and then maybe perhaps doing like a, a, a white glitter cut crease on the inside. Um, I've no idea why I'm doing a cut crease without a mirror. Um, but you know, it's fun <laughs> to not use a mirror and do your makeup. I'm going to go in with the Laura Lee palette, Cat's Pajamas is the name of the palette. I love, love the packaging of this palette. If you know me, you know I love things that shine and sparkle. Sparkle's always good. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to change brushes. Um, it's a Woolies brand brush. It is called a blender um, number 35 but I don't use it for blending I use it for pretty much anything that I feel like using it for. okay so I'm gonna start with kooky is the name of that shade wish me luck guys And again, just doing it in circular motions all the way out to the end of my eyebrow. Not that I can see where that is. Oh, right, guys, by the way, thanks for watching my YouTube video. Please don't forget to click the subscribe button for some more awesome videos. And I'm going on to my left eye. Just working it in. Da, da, da. Da, da. Um, okay, I'm sure that's enough. Now I'm gonna go in with the in one ear shade. It's more of the burgundy ready maroon color. Use this um, makeup brush. Um, I got this as a gift for my 21st birthday from one of my friends. Um, let me tell you something about these. If you've ever used them or have been thinking about using them, please do yourself a favor and get them. But they honestly have the softest brushes. Oh, I cannot. It feels so good against your skin. It feels like baby kisses. Okay. So now I'm going to go in with the in one ear. So this one I'm just going to stick into my crease. Just stay in the crease using backwards and forwards motions. Just get in the corner of my eye. The eyelid and just in the crease and just backwards and forwards motions. That should be suffice. Okay, next I'm going to go into my other eye. Go into the corner of that eye, girl. Does it look good, guys? Be honest. I can actually feel product falling onto my face. Exhibit B. As to why I do not put foundation on first. You know, and I'm not bashing anybody who puts foundation on first. Um, I mean, everyone has their little techniques. And I feel like I have first eyeshadow in my eyes. I like to use this to get any color that I would like to put inside my crease. Because it's so such a defined brush. I sometimes also use it for underneath my eyebrow. So now I'm going to go in with... The color oddball um, it's the pitch black color over there um, and I'm just gonna put a little bit on the brush and just rub it in the corner there I don't even know what I'm doing guys <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing I'm probably doing so bad at this Now I'm going to go back in with the eyeshadow base, um, the Essence one, uh, just to cut the crease. I felt so much excess eyeshadow go onto my eyes. You guys are probably all laughing at me right now. I probably look like such a clown. Just pat that in. Now I'm going to use the I Am Fushini um 
Power Palette. I'm going to uh, use the white shade uh, to do the cut crease. Um, with glittery colors, I like to just pat the product on because I feel like it sticks better rather than blending it. Guys, feel free to laugh at me. Just put on some more for good luck. Now, I'm going to take this brush, which is also um, from the Unicorn Collection, and I'm just going to use it to blend the two colors together. Okay. Okay. So now, before we go on, <laughs> I'm just going to clean up the excess because I know 100% that there's excess on the bottom of my eye because I could feel it dropping throughout the... <laughs> Look at all of that! Wow! Wow! Jeepers, I'd be arrested from the makeup release. cream and all my primer off at the moment but I will re really put it on and get back to you in a second so I'm going to put the gold color over there so now <laughs> here comes the fun part I'm going to use my <laughs> liquid liner to line my upper lash line um, I'm not going to wing because, <laughs> well, you know because. So I'm using the Elizabeth Arden um, liquid liner. That's what it is. This is the color Seriously Black. Oh, I just poked my eye, I could feel it. This feels so bad. So bad. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in and put on eyeliner. Um, I just wanna have a bit of a disclaimer. I do not use normal eye pencils or normal eyeliners <laughs> my eyes feel so funny i'm sorry my eyes feel so bad i just want to have a little bit of a disclaimer i do not use regular eye pencil for my eyeliner um, i use black eyeshadow and it really does burn when you put it on so please don't try it at home so i'm going to go back in with oddball from the laura lee palette i'm just going to use this to my eye. Okay. Ooh, now I'm going to go in with this Born to Go Liquid Illuminator from NYX. I really like to use this underneath my foundation. I'm just going to put some over here. I'm just going to go in with the bigger beauty blender, get that all the way up to my hairline, down my nose. How does one know when you're done patting? Now I'm going to go in with my foundation. I use the Revlon Insta Filter Photo Ready Foundation. This is such a good foundation. It's not cakey at all. It's full coverage it's thick and creamy i use two shades because unfortunately they don't have my shade in this foundation so i'm going to put these foundations on my face pull that down to my neck
Now I'm going to go in with my concealer. The concealer that I use is Fit Me by Maybelline in the shade 20. Hoping and praying that I'm doing it right. So once that's done, I like to go in with my highlighter, my Ruby Kiss highlighter brush. And I am going to use the NYX highlighter stick in the color Chardonnay Shimmer. Um, and I just like to put that directly on my cheekbone. I'm going to use another one of the unicorn brushes. Just blend it in. And I'm going to put on mascara. I use two different mascaras. I eat both are Essence. The one is I Love Extreme in blue. And there's the False, false Lashes. Um, Extreme Volume and Curl. Squeeze those lashes together. And finally, I'm going to now go in with the lipstick. I'm going to use NYX lip liner and a NYX soft matte lip cream. The lip liner is in the color Prune and the lipstick is in the color SMLC32. The color is called Rome. So I'm just going to... Hope for the best. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to go in with the and the look is complete. <laughs> I probably look like such a buffoon, but thank you all for watching. Thanks for sticking around to watch me make myself look really terrible. To view the final product, here goes nothing. Wow, my lipstick's on fleek. <laughs> Who knew I could? Wow, wow, wow. I don't even put lipstick on this good when I'm looking in the mirror. Wow. Wow. Guys, um, my eyes though, like what is even going on in those eyes? What is going on in my eyes, guys? <laughs> wow what is this this is not even a cut crease this is me just entirely taking over the entire eye with this color wow I'm I'm shocked look at my eyes anyway thanks guys for watching um, I really enjoyed that I hope you did for some more awesome videos click that subscribe button 